It's time for the program program. MSU TV's only show bringing you a close look at academic programs at Moorhead State University. On tonight's episode, Professor of Photography, Robin Moore, and MSU Photography minor, Juliana Leach. And now, the host of the program program, John Modaff. Thank you, Tim. Welcome, everybody, to the program program. You know what it's about, academic programs. This time we're talking about photography, a photography minor at Moorhead State University. And with us from the faculty side is Robin Moore. She's a photographer and filmmaker hailing from Virginia. She holds an MFA in photography and experimental film. And she has also a PhD in visual arts and photo media. I guess that MFA just didn't do it for you, did it? It was, wasn't enough. Her work has been exhibited widely around the world, you might say, including numerous locations in Australia and from coast to coast in the United States. Robin Moore is the recipient of numerous distinguished residencies and awards. She's currently an assistant professor of photography in the Department of Art and Design at Moorhead State University. And Dr. Moore helped to create and works to develop MSU's photography minor, the subject of today's program program. Welcome to the show, Robin. Thank you so much for having me. It's great, and thanks for taking time to come. Well, if you were going to tell somebody who just didn't know anything mm -hmm. about a photography minor or what's involved mm -hmm. about the program at MSU, how would you pitch it to them? Um, well, I would sort of talk about the program as one that offered a lot of different perspectives on photography. Um, what I really value and cherish about our minor here is um, that it offers a variety of approaches to making photographic images. Um, so, for example, um, in art and design, which is sort of my part of things, um, we offer more uh, fine art perspective, personal expression perspective, but then um, as well within the convergent uh, media, the CVM branch of the minor, mm -hmm. there's all these other perspectives, photojournalistic perspectives, we have video production, um, storytelling perspectives, um, and so the minor itself is crafted to offer a, a really broad experience of photography that would be really applicable in a lot of different situations, thinking post-graduation, thinking not only you know personal satisfaction, but also employability mm -hmm. and that sort of thing. Um, so the variety of approaches that the minor embodies is really important, um, but also the idea of the photograph as a crafted object or a crafted image um, with uh, our, our sort of contemporary experience of, of photographic images, um, including myself, um, you know, it's easy to pick up an iPhone or a smartphone and snap away, tap that screen and, and snap away. And, and those are very valuable. I, I'm, I'm not knocking smartphone photography. It can be quite beautiful. It's really important for record keeping. Mm -hmm. um, but from the photography minor perspective, um, we try to really encourage students to think about the, the photogra photographic image as a handcrafted object in mm -hmm. a way. Um, that requires um, and encourages thinking, higher level thinking, um, imagination, um, and, and so I think that's important. And then sort of the, the other thing that I really cherish about the minor is the idea of honing and discovering one's personal aesthetic. Mm -hmm. So um, each student sees differently, each student has something important to say and, and bring to the world. Yes. Um, each student has a very unique perspective Everybody's coming from really special, unique places, and that's what a personal aesthetic is about, or discovering one's personal aesthetic. It's, it's how can each student uh, um, look at themselves and their history and, and express that in their own way. Yes. And so I'd say those, those three sort of ideas are really central to the minor, and, and that's what the minor would offer a student. Awesome. That gives us a sense of what's involved and also the variety of perspectives students can expect to encounter mm -hmm. and that they can develop their own work. Mm -hmm. Does a student have to be an experienced or a skilled photographer to uh, choose this minor, or are, are you ready to work with people at any stage in development? Um, the latter. So, um, in fact, um, so no, to answer your question, you can come to the minor um, with no experience in photography whatsoever. Um, you don't have to be um, a convergent media major. You don't have to be an art and design major. Um, I've had um, agricultural science students be photo minors, um, you know, engineering students be photo minors. Um, you, you could, just like other minors, um, you don't have to have any experience coming into the minor. Um, and you can come from any place in the university in terms of your, your discipline. Um, and in fact, um, I think that's one of the strengths is that there's no, there's no real gate <laughs> except mm -hmm. enthusiasm mm -hmm. and desire. Very and good. that 
gets for me that's important enthusiasm and desire um, I teach a lot of introductory level classes that part of the core there are clearly several introductory level classes and I love when I have a mix of, of students coming from different places I think that that breeds strength yes. um, in cross-disciplinary investigations um, and in just conversation in the classroom that um, if we were more um, you know, if we limited for some reason the, the kind of background someone had, right. um, I think it would be really detrimental. So, um, yeah. one, one of the strengths of the program is that pretty much anybody can be a photo miner. Very good. Well, Dr. Robin Moore, thank you so much for telling us about the program. And speaking of students, we're going to speak with a student in the second half of today's show. We'll be right back. Thank you. You're welcome. And everybody, stay tuned to the program program. <laughs> Welcome back to the program program. My name is Austin Brewer and I'm here with our photography minor, Juliana Leach. Hello, G Juliana. Hey. Uh, so to start this interview, uh, what did Moorhead offer that made you want to come to the photography minor here? Well, it wasn't the photography minor at first because when I first got here, they weren't offering it yet. So what led me to Moorhead was the convergent media program. I was really interested in a major that would allow me to kind of dive into all sorts of media. And then when the photography minor opened up, I think about my sophomore year, I just dove right into it. I was really excited that they were gonna offer it and it was right up my alley at the time, because I, oh, and now, because it uh, was more about photography and that's where my passion is, so. Hmm. All right, uh, what reasons did you have to be interested in it? Like, Well, I originally kind of had a different track and then I ended up at Moorhead. I was originally going to go into environmental conservation, and so I wanted to kind of be a reason why environmental laws are created, sort of uh, promoting in a way. I wanted to kind of do nature pictures or like landscape, something that kind of showed the beauty of the world. And then once I got to this major, I quickly realized that that wasn't what I wanted. I ended up kind of falling in love with this idea of unbiased journalism. And so when I fell in love with that, photography changed for me and I fell in love with the idea of taking pictures of people. So that's what initially kind of sparked my interest in the photography minor after that was that I really wanted to go into, uh, go into different aspects of photography that wasn't my original intention. So that's kind of how I got here. All right. Um, so for your future career, what kind of challenges do you think you'll be facing? I plan on going into journalism. I think that there's a lot of ethical concerns like when it comes to photography sometimes, like what you should and should not take pictures of and different things like that. But I think that's the main concern that could come up in my future career. And what kind of challenges did you face in the photography minor itself? So in the minor, I was with the Convergent Media major, I was full on into photojournalism and documentary photography. But there's this whole other side of the photography minor that's more about art. And so when I started taking those art classes, I quickly realized that there's a big difference in what each side really asks for. So that was a challenge, but it was a good challenge. It was something that made me think about the types of pictures that I take and what different techniques for each side of photography can bring to the table. All right, well, thank you for being on the show and we will be right back with John Modaff. Hi, I'm Jay Morgan, president of Moorhead State University. You're watching MSU TV. Well, that's it for the program program this time. We talked about the photography minor at Moorhead State University. And if you'd like some more information, check out the graphic on the page right now, and you'll see you can get in contact very easily. Check it out. Thank you, Austin. Nice work talking to Juliana. Thank you for having me. It's been an honor. All right. Well, best to you. And everybody out there in TV land, watch for the next program program. You never know what we've got up our sleeve besides our arms. All right, we'll see you.